what's going on everybody i am back with a brand new youtube video and not only that i am back with a ep slash album review um i had to remember that this is not an album it's it's a ep um and this is jojo y'all know i love my girl jojo like y'all know i'm y'all know i'm ride or die you know the queen talented y'all know she just yeah she 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 be giving that that that's exactly what she be doing um she didn't release this ep on october 1st which is today i just got done listening to it and i'm actually staying up late as hell to do this because i know that tomorrow once the sun comes up I'm gonna be so busy. I'm doing a, I'm doing some different stuff where, um, yeah, that that you know that's that's very very creative and which I'm not gonna. You know what? My words not coming out right, but y'all get the point. When you busy, stuff come up. And um, I just said, let me knock this out of the way because I really wanted to listen to it, and I had to listen to it twice. So I didn't rush through it because I really wanted to know like what i like what i didn't like what could be better what's not so y'all know normally i do track by track um i cannot remember all the lyrics and stuff by heart however i i can't remember how some of these songs sound but we're just gonna get into um what i like the most first and then we'll get into the tracks First of all, okay, so let's talk about the intro, World of Sunshine. First of all, her vocals on it, uh, awesome. Like, when it, just, when it first start to come on, y'all will see exactly what I'm talking about. Um, so this one was produced by Jordan XL. Um, also, he was somebody that worked with her on her first album and also on her second album can you believe that so i don't know how record labels used to work back then but somehow i guess you know if you're a writer or you're a producer you know you can jump from label to labels i think it's different when it comes to producers and stuff but i was happy to see that i looked into that Dazaw, which is track number three, which was really, really, really cute. I thought that it was very, very creative how she did that. Um, she's definitely talking about a dude. And I know I've said that millions of times when I talk about these album reviews. And I thought, she's like, you make me dissolve by the way that you do me or how you treat me. That's basically what she was saying, in, you know, on the EP. Um, track number five, B.I.D. Oh, my God. Now that right, now that song right there. Yeah, she talking about how good she is, you know, when it when it comes to uh, yeah, that department. I was like, okay, JoJo, like, okay, you grown, yeah, uh, uh yeah, feeling that one. Feel all right was I really really liked Feel All Right. It was definitely a calm, soothing type of record. I definitely could dig with that fresh new sheets when you listen to that that song it, it's good and i think around the three minute mark it starts to fade out and then it starts to come back the sugar and carbs interlude vocals she's displaying nothing on vocals not only is she displaying nothing but vocals on that one. she also did it in bid2 which is one of my favorite tracks on the ep um, spiral season all oh, the instrumental is just bananas like it's it's cute it reminds me of um send me your location like the, the the beat that's what it kind of reminds me of but but of course the queen jojo like yeah uh worse i assume Oh, so Tierra Thomas is also a part of this record too, okay? Oh, well, 
I like work so I assume the video was already out. I'm getting ready to look at the new music video that she did release tonight. You guys go check it out on her official YouTube channel and on streaming services. Uh, um, the songs that I didn't go through, I have to listen to them again. But also, I did listen to the whole album, well, the whole EP. So I think the whole EP is just bananas. I, I freaking love it. Go stream it, stream it, buy it, download. Give her your coin. She deserves all the love. Especially since maybe she's not getting any coin from what Black Brown Records had put out with her first two albums. So go support her. She needs your coin. I will continue. To, I will continue to support this queen. I mean, the album ten out of a ten EP. I keep saying album EP. I mean, listen, all I can say, I'd be glad when I can actually actually go on tour and see her if she comes here in Memphis. Like, I think that would be so iconic. Mm, that'd be so iconic. But you guys, until next time, thank you so much for watching.